Hello everybody and welcome to Key Cam and the Fam. And today guys, today I am making tacos for my family. Yum. What excuse me? Yum, yum. So today I have my ground beef. I have my taco shells. I'm using classic garden for my lettuce because it has carrots and all of that other good stuff in there. I have my tomatoes. I have my Mexican style um cheese, top El Paso seasoning, sour cream, jalapeno peppers, adobo seasoning, and pecani. I almost called it paste. But my pecani sauce and my black pepper. So guys, my as you see my ground beef, it's still frozen. Mm -hmm. But it's still gonna stop me from cooking. No, nope, absolutely I'm not. What I'm going to do, you all seen me do this before, but I'm gonna do it again. I always add a little, you know what? Let me just take you to, to the pot and let you see what I do. Okay, so guys, what I'm doing, I'm opening up my pack of ground beef. And it's froze. I mean, it's frozen, solid. Okay, guys, so I put in my ground beef. I rinsed it off first. I always do that habit, especially when it's frozen. Okay. So we're going to add and water to this. And this is going to have to cook a little bit faster. So we're going to go in with our black pepper. And our adobo all-purpose seasoning. So guys, I'm going to put the top on this and we're going to allow this to cook for 20 minutes and I'll bring you guys back. So guys, the meat has been cooking probably about 5 minutes at the most, so I'm breaking it up so the rest of the meat can cook. And this is the water that I put in here. So I will bring you guys back when this ground beef is ready for me to drain which will be in another 15 minutes. Why Do you, you have that key? Why are you dancing? Because I am dancing though. So I will bring you guys back once this meat, I will bring you guys back <laughs> once this meat have browned in 15, in 15 minutes. minutes. See you guys in a sec. Well guys, as you can see, my ground beef is ready to be drained. So I'm gonna drain this and I'm gonna put my seasoning packet in here and I'll bring you guys back. Mm. Yes. Look at that. Don't this look good? Yeah. You ready to eat? Yeah. Okay, let me let me hurry up so I can feed my family. Bring you guys back. <laughs> okay guys, I'm back. So now I'm getting ready to use my El Paso taco seasoning. And this is the mouth. Man, this is so hard. This pack, I don't know why they do these packages like this. This, man, it'd be crazy the way they do this. It's like, well, I understand everything is child proof. Okay, so we're gonna use the entire pack of El Paso taco seasoning and we're going to pour a little water in and now I'm going to turn the fire back on and I'm just going to stir this up it smells so good And we're just going to let this simmer for about two or three minutes. And while that's simmering, we're going to cut up our tomatoes and cut up some of this lettuce, this, um, this salad kit. So we're going to go over to the counter and we're going to let this simmer. Let me turn this down. Okay, so I'm going to take you guys over to the counter. We have two medium-sized tomatoes. And we're just cutting the top off. And 
I cut my tomatoes up. I don't cut them really, really small, but I love tomatoes. Can't lie. Now, I don't think everybody in the house really like them as much as I do, but I love my tomatoes. I don't think you're on key like on um, a whole nother level of tomato lover. Yeah. And guys, I, I know you get ready to say why you, I haven't used my new knives. I'm sorry, guys. They actually still sit on the table. <laughs> so don't come for my husband. You cut them so neat. You say what? You cut them so neat. Do I? Well, thank yeah. you. Okay, so that's one tomato. And we're going to, like I said, I'm using the classic garlic, I mean, I'm sorry, the classic garden um, salad kit. The tomatoes, look, they look so bad. They look, actually, to be honest with you, that salad look, the lettuce looked really old. Y'all know me. I can't feed my family anything. I love them too much. I can't just give them anything. So. Uh, yeah. Right, so we're gonna cut this up, and this have um, they have iceberg lettuce and carrots and red cabbage. So we're gonna cut this up, not a whole lot, but just enough to sprinkle over our taco. Y'all know Keon wanted her diet, so. So what can? None of the Yeah. <clears throat> He's on a diet, so. She gonna have all this just to hear. She's on one of her many diets. You know how that is. <laughs> Man, she needs to quit worrying about being on a diet. Mm -hmm. so, I have to hear about this. When y'all see this video, we're gonna mukbang this video. We're gonna, I'm sorry, we're gonna mukbang these tacos. Just watch Key. Focus on Key. And, and tell me, do it look like she's on a diet? I've been seeing y'all messages asking me, sending me, when are you doing a cooking video? I missed you guys too. But it seemed like, you know, they had so many challenges to do. So my cooking videos, they just... When I fail, they just... When you have to do those challenges, what you all had to challenge, I wasn't cooking it, so... Yeah. Mm -mm. Okay, so we have our lettuce. And we have our tomatoes cut up. And this is what we're going to put on top of our tacos. So our meat is ready. We're gonna turn this off. We're gonna turn that off. Oh God. And we're gonna put our taco shell in the oven for one to two minutes. Well guys, as you can see, I am through cooking. My family, they're gonna make their own tacos. And, and if you guys wanna see us mukbang these tacos, then catch us for our 6 p.m. upload. And when I tell you, this meat smells so good. Oh my goodness, it smells, I'm, I'm just, Cam, hurry up and finish recording so I can sit down and eat my taco. Mm, got you. Gotta have the sour cream. Of course, we're gonna probably have hot sauce as well. But guys, thank you so much for watching. Don't forget to check out Keys Way, Caminata Games, and as always, the cutest couple on YouTube. It's a love thing. What? Cutest couple? Cu cutest couple. Oh, we gotta change that. So I'll see you guys in the next video. Bye!